time now is 12 11 on thursday the 1st of june at 2017 you wait for your started lows 1208 one alpha 26 version traders curses released to london king's cross Time now is 12.14. You wait for your 12.18, one dollar 11 version trains East Coast to from London Kings Cross to Leeds. Will I get any far back shots today? I might do. Because I know that... Um, when we're looking, 1 alpha 9 is not run by a Virgin Trains East Coast unit. So I might go back to my normal shot just over there. Don't see why not. If this side of the road is always mostly going to be clear, I might as well take the chance. Let's check trains behind her. Uh, Remember 83 no ground from which is 1229. Another appearances. Of course you know forthcoming this weekend is the start of the summer voyage. Which of course will include Ben, Adam and Daniel, De Dennis specifically. I don't like calling him Daniel, even though he prefers that. Who's of course the Daniel Brown debacle a few years back. That basically just pushed him off end of. I couldn't put up with it. 
But yeah. We're doing our stations this week. Shane will be doing them next week. I don't know how that works, but yeah. Is an East Midlands. Broken glass when that clatters together. Just to also wait for the next trains. This little bit is 22 Next trains are about seven minutes. There's a random bit of rail over there now. Don't know if it was there before. But also the person attending to it left their high visibility here. Oh dear. They might need that. Okay, time now is 12.26, you wait for your 12.30, one number 83, version trains, East Coasters from London, Kings Cross to York. This has to be one of the longest amber lights I've ever seen. At least six to seven seconds. Bloody hell. Normally barriers are starting off by then. Okay. The train's a little bit from Newark, so I've got time to cross over if I wish to. But do I? Because it's all going to get quite close in the next 10 15 minutes. As I said, I'm waiting here for a train that's not run by Virgin today. Then, of course, there's a battle of another service. Well, let me just tell you what a Co 9 Edinburgh London is not a Virgin train. And that's expected now 1243. It could all go tits up because, of course, if one share of 15 is expected at 12.44 in Newark, that will double pass here with that train. So do I or don't I? Just check where this non-version unit is. Not yet appeared at Retford, okay. So still a little while away. Nor am I sure if the Great Western Railway 180-108 is out for Grand Central today. As Great Western Railway is passing over all of their 180s to Grand Central, then when the Grand Central HSTs go, they'll only have 180s. Currently the first I think to make the move is 180-108 from Great Western Railway. Comedy used to run, run, I think, between Paddington and Great Malvern. If not further up to Hereford. Or maybe just to um, Oxford or Reading. In Paddington's terms, Radley or Twyford. Okay. There's this fun. Yeah, I've got time to move. I think I'll head over to my normal sit-down place. Next train's approaching Newark, so I don't really trust the control centre. And I get in a place and then stop the video. Only perch about here. So thank you, we'll see you when the next train comes.
I like I'm a bit further back than normal. Time now is 12.30. Great for your slightly delayed, 12.19, when I curl away, Virgin Trains East Coast from, from Edinburgh Waverley to London King's Cross. Let me just check behind that, even though that does stop at Newark, there should be a Grand Central from Bradford right behind it. How close behind it is it? A few signals, it's just at Bathley. So you will also wait for your 12.32 and off for 63, possibly Grand Central. Service from Bradford to change to London King's Cross. Like I said, I don't know what diagrams one you want to wait for Great Western Railways on today. But it is still in the old Great Western Railway um, dynamic lines, I think they call it. It's what they call the HSTs. Then it's what they call the other deliveries, dynamic lines. So I don't think any of them are gone in Great Western Green, because of course if they were going to Grand Central that would be pointless. But do as they want, of course. The road's completely clear. Only me parked in the distance. It is a good little spot back here. Okay, one I eight just left Newark. Oh, there's a vehicle. Coming around from Balderton. There's another car. Looking at me and then going straight in the way. Chucking something out of the car. You can see the plate. Yeah, the Grand Central is literally right behind it at the flat crossing. So, no doubt, after those two, I've already read you also wait for your 1236, 192, Grand Central, London, Sunderland. So, that's delayed 1219, one of away, Edinburgh, London. 12.32 and off for 63 Bradford, London. 12.36, one of the nine two London at Sunderland. The next train has just passed on to Newark, but of course we'll have to stop because there's no clearance through here yet. Edinburgh. The next train is way too close to let anyone through. Because it is literally right at Newark Northgate. And is not this to be a stopping train either. So the next Edinburgh stopping for Newark is way back near Grantham. Where's the one I'm looking for? Don't give me a stupid answer. Uh, just past Retford. That is a stupid answer. I'm doubting any of the next two units are the Great Western Railway 180. I think they're just probably normal Grand Central. Because of course it is their service. If I have the diagrams for 108, I would deliberately call it Great Western Railway service. Okay, there is a bit of clearance, so the train should have at least a double yellow through Newark, which is caution. Okay, just past Newark Northgate, the train should be here in about a minute or two time. 1 November 92 at Claypole, that'll be here in about a minute or two. You've just reached over five minutes.
Okay, so the one way at four is expected at 43. That might clash with another service. Bugger. Okay, Bradford. Great Western Railway 180108. I was hoping to see that because I didn't catch it the other day. I was actually too busy. Oh well, we've seen it now. Next we'll see that in Grand Central. And the number is very clear on that, both sides. Pity it's still got the same crappy design as whole trains use. But after so much wear and tear, you can't even see the unit number on the coach, let alone the main front and back. Okay, it's Sunderland. I was just shy of at seven minutes. As I was passing over to come to this side because I don't trust these next trains to sit on this bit of rail, that barrier there was making a hissing noise as if it was pumping itself back up almost constantly. Time now is 12.40. You wait for your 12.43, 1 Sierra 15 from London King's Cross to Edinburgh. Your slight delay 12.30, Sim 1 9 from Edinburgh to London King's Cross. Not sure about three. But I don't trust myself enough to wait across the other side. Yeah, there is three. And your 12, slight delay 1241, 1 Alpha 28 from Leeds to London King's Cross. So this should be a threesome, that's why I'm not trusting that other side at all. Oh, I'd read it wrong. Your 1237, 1 9 cross country high speed train service from Edinburgh to London King's Cross. You'll know why momentarily. Due to a train hitting a cow yesterday on its way up to Aberdeen. Yes, a stubborn cow it was. I think the front end was completely damaged, which took it out of use. Which then arrived, I think, about 250 odd late into Edinburgh. 250 odd late. Stubborn cow. There's me thinking that VTEX, such and such train, will be there to compensate. It was a bit of a late post. Then checked the times and thought, bloody hell. For the compensation team, by God, it's Christmas come early, I must say. Northern still working back in February, I think, if not March, and it's June now. They're all so far behind. Yeah, Echo 09 is now approaching Newark. Once the Air 15 is about to pass us in a moment. So it wasn't worth trusting it. If I end up missing one Sierra 15's driving van trailer, which I think is an 82, if I end up missing the DVT, I don't care. Because I use AB Rail to match up the codes to the coaching stop, which normally gives the accurate DVT. So that should work. Okay, cross country and version trains east coast please note due to an earlier train involved in an incident this train is only formed of seven coaches not nine. I could have trusted it, but I didn't want to. Okay, just waiting for one alpha 28 approaching the flat crossing. Now 
me just check the list for any others close by afterwards. We're now 43. Uh, 52, 7 and 7. Huh. I don't know what to do with that side. Yeah, I know I'm a bit more wobbly this side. My hand's now gone numb. Oh, there we go. I mentioned it many times before, but if we turn around and look behind the box there, there is an old arm, and the camera's focusing more on the fence. I think there's only one arm here. There's one arm at Claypole still. Uh, there's about 25 arms now resting at Ely. I think all from the same side as well. And it's all a bit awire. Because all that ends up going is either they go into railway, railway recycling or they just stay where they are. Now like this bit of rail here. Then if it's gone to the recycling site, or it's just going to stay here. I don't even know if it's new or not. Wouldn't think so if it's already rusty. But the chance could be a fine thing. And Delta 12 is at Grant from OK. And that's, I think, for 52. Okay, then, last train of this closure. One off for 28, Leeds, London. Before I finish off, I've noticed this sign lying around on most sides. Barnby in the Willows to be held on the village screen on Saturday the 3rd of June, 1200 hours to finish. What time is finish? Thanks for watching today's videos here from Barnby Road. Today, of course, we feature diversion trains East Coast, Grand Central, Great Western Railway and Cross Country. Just a final thing to note, whilst I'm here, I have checked and I am in a bit of clearance, but I'm pretty sure this, this, this light set is starting to fall down. So start, I noticed on the other side it is starting to lean even further. Looks like it as well. Oh well, there's a vest. That signal sense has been out of use for years and it's all been controlled to clay polish. You can see on Inside King's Cross a few months back. So this was Barnby Road. We'll see you on Saturday.